Friday, June 14th, 4 p.m. Mountain Time, 2019. Guys, over the past few years, we've been fascinated by videos surfacing from all around the world of strange sounds coming from the sky. Well, yesterday on the 13th, I received two videos from two different people from two different locations of strange sounds coming from the sky. Up here in the North Sea area, I got a video from Denmark. I got a video from Southeast England. And the young lady that sent the video from Southeast England, it was in the evening time. The video from Denmark was later on that night after dark. The gentleman from Denmark was filming a rare lightning storm, and as I was watching the video, I heard these strange sounds come from the sky. He never mentioned it. He didn't do any narrating. He was just showing me the lightning that is rather rare for Denmark. And in the video from Southeast England, the young lady definitely narrates as she's hearing something come from the sky. It's not a boat. It's not a ship. It's not an airplane. She's very familiar with all those noises. Whatever she heard was coming from the sky. So let's get to the videos. I want to share those real quick. But first, we're going to take a look at the lightning map here at the website. This is the real-time lightning tab right here. And I'm not trying to push the lightning tab or the website. I just simply want to share something with you that is an incredible observation. We're witnessing lightning span for over 4,000 miles, the entire length of North America, and then some. We're going from far northern Canada clear down into southern Mexico down in the Caribbean. This extends over 4,000 miles of lightning. I've never seen that before, so I just wanted to share that in a video real quick. We're going from literally, that shows 3,800 miles, and that's just a random guess. It's actually a little bit further. It's around 4,000 miles the lightning is extending. We're going to get to these videos here from the UK and one from Denmark, right up in this area here, southeast England and up here in Denmark. And the video I'm going to start with first is the one from England. In fact, here's the email she sent me dated June 13th, 2019. She says, hi, Michael. This is a video of some weird sounds coming from the sky over in southeast England. I hope it plays okay. There isn't much to see, but you can definitely hear the strange trumpet sounds coming from the sky. Thanks, Debs. That's the young lady's name that sent the video in of the strange sounds from Southeast England. The young lady steps outside and points her camera up to the, the cloudy sky. It's not raining or anything, and you can hear these strange noises. So here we go. This is video number one. I don't think you can get this, but it's... Um Really weird noises. Nothing to really say. But just it's really weird noises. It's very windy. She said she had never heard anything like that before, and like I said, she'd lived there her entire life. The next video is from Denmark, just up across the North Sea, same night, just after dark. The gentleman was recording a rare lightning storm when I happened to notice a weird sound that had to have come from the sky. Check it out. You'll see what I mean.
Okay, there was only a couple in that video clip from Denmark, but they were quite obvious, at least to me. They didn't fit in with the, the thunderstorm or the lightning. It was some sort of a high-pitched, weird sound that just didn't fit in. There weren't any cars. There wasn't any city traffic. It was very late at night. It was between 11 and 12 o'clock at night. And an another thing that I want to point out yesterday, the Schumann Resonance had a big spike between 13 and 20, which is about a seven hour period. I'm just saying it's a coincidence that there were strange sounds coming from the sky over in Great Britain and in Denmark. The Schumann showed a big spike and people noticed strange sounds coming from the sky. So thanks for sharing guys. I greatly appreciate it. Once again, this lightning is quite fascinating as it extends for over 4,000 or right at 4,000 miles, getting up above the 60 degree latitude, going well down into the 20 degree latitude. I'm at 30, so this is down in the 20. We're down in the Caribbean, northern Canada to the Caribbean. I mean, that's just, you don't see that very often. I mean, in fact, I watch this all the time, and I've never seen it. Kind of like this uh, photo here from Fresno, California, sent in by Mary. We've all seen the halos around the sun. It's becoming a new rule instead of the exception. It happens all the time, all over the world. But as you can see here, now we're getting into double halos around the sun that are closer together, not real far apart. These are right close together, less than five degrees apart. Look at that. She caught this just yesterday in Fresno, California. That's a double halo around the sun, or at least part of a double halo. I've never seen that. I've seen double halos, but they were quite far apart. This is very close together. So that there is something that's kind of new. The strange sounds coming from the sky isn't necessarily anything new. We've heard that a few times over the years. In fact, quite a few times, but I found those quite fascinating. Thanks for sharing, guys, and thanks for the new photos. We've got some new photos and video here at the Sky Phenomena Photo Gallery. This one here was sent in by Tony from Taylorsville. Sky briefly looked like Jupiter for a moment. Just incredible, big brown line through the sky. This here looks like the electric blue phenomenon sent in by Heather. This photo here is just uh, about two or three days old. Great photograph, and I'm not exactly sure of the location. This one here I do, Lebanon, Connecticut, sent in by Joseph, of what looks like a triangle-shaped craft or something up in the sky. Tori W. sent in this really cool cloud. Looks like a giant butterfly in the sky. Just amazing, amazing pink purple sky sent in by Kaz. Absolutely gorgeous. Look at that purple and pink sky. I mean, you can't make this stuff up. This is from Slovenia sent in by Ben, and he said it's the first time they'd ever seen it over there. This is a big, high profile shelf cloud, leading edge of a big thunderstorm. This is from New York sent in by Dwayne of the Full Moon. Dripping Springs, Texas, another lightning storm sent in by Frank. And this is from this week. And it finishes off, or it actually began, with this shelf cloud from Dripping Springs, Texas. And here's that halo again. I've got it in the video. And you can see I've kind of adjusted the color where it shows up a little better in this video uh, presentation. You can see a secondary line very close to the primary line. I mean, and I, like I said, I remember years ago when those things, you never even saw one. And now you're seeing them all the time, so something has definitely changed. Northeast Georgia, windy, big colorful sky near the sun. And that little thing right there is the sun. This next photograph is one of those spectacular. And again, years ago, you didn't see these things. A high-profile double rainbow. All you used to see years ago when I was a kid, and like I said, Countless times before in videos, we played outside all the time growing up. We spent a lot of time outside working on farms. We were no strangers to thunderstorms or rainbows. We never saw double rainbows. So, guys, this is something kind of new. I know it's been around for 
a few years, but it's, it's, it's at least new to me. And, you know, I said, remember growing up, we never saw these. So quite the new rule instead of the exception. Double rainbows. Now we're getting into double halos around the sun. So fascinating times. Now we're hearing these strange sounds coming from the sky again over in Denmark and in southeast England. Good observation, guys. Thanks for watching. Have a super day and be safe out there.